In the vast cosmos, two celestial forces collide. The Silver Surfer, the Herald of Galactus, and Thor, the God of Thunder, prepare for an epic clash. The Silver Surfer, once a mortal man named Norin Rad, now wields the Power Cosmic, a force that allows him to manipulate matter and energy at will. Riding his shimmering silver board, he roams the universe as the Herald of Galactus, the Devourer of Worlds. On the other side, we have Thor, the Asgardian God of Thunder. Born to the Allfather Odin, Thor wields the mighty Mjolnir, a hammer forged in the heart of a dying star. Its thunderous power is matched only by Thor's godly strength. The stage is set, the celestial bodies align and cosmic energies ripple across the universe, heralding the impending clash of these titanic forces. As the universe watches with bated breath, the first blow is about to be struck. With a thunderous roar, Thor lunges at the surfer, Mjolnir in hand, but the surfer is swift, evading the god of thunder with ease. The clash of the titans has begun. Every movement every blow exchanged resonates with the power and intensity of these two formidable beings. Thor, the mighty god of thunder armed with his enchanted hammer Mjolnir is relentless in his assault. His attacks are brutal and unyielding, reflecting his warrior spirit and indomitable will. Each swing of Mjolnir sends shockwaves through the air, the force of his strikes enough to shake the very foundations of the cosmos. However the Silver Surfer, renowned sentinel of the spaceways, is not easily bested. His movements are a symphony of grace and power, evading Thor's aggressive onslaught with an almost serene calm. His cosmic powers allow him to create obstacles and distractions, from cosmic energy blasts to creating miniature black holes, all designed to keep Thor off balance. Yet Thor is undeterred. He meets each of the surfer's counterattacks with a fierce determination that only a god could possess. His command over lightning and thunder adds another level of complexity to the battle. With a mere gesture, storms are summoned, lightning crackles and thunder roars, echoing Thor's battle cry across the infinite expanse of the cosmos. The surfer, despite his cosmic powers and speed, finds himself hard-pressed to gain an upper hand. Thor's divine strength and relentless attack keep him on the defensive, constantly evading and countering rather than taking the offensive. Thor's attacks are like the relentless tide, a force of nature that refuses to be denied, pressing the surfer further and further back. Despite the surfer's cosmic powers, Thor's divine strength and relentless assault continue to press the surfer on the back foot. This clash of the titans is far from over but for now, Thor holds the upper hand. But the surfer is not defeated yet, with a surge of cosmic energy he strikes back sending Thor sprawling. This is the moment. The moment the silver surfer seemingly on the ropes channels his cosmic might to turn the tides of this epic clash. He's down but not out, and he's not going down without a fight. His strategy is simple, yet effective. He's using his powers to exploit Thor's weaknesses, a calculated move that shows his intelligence. He's not just a powerhouse, he's a tactician. He uses his speed, his agility, his ability to manipulate energy, everything at his disposal to push the God of Thunder back. Thor, the mighty warrior, is taken aback. He struggles, tries to regain his footing, but the surfer's relentless assault keeps him off balance. What a twist! The tables have turned and the momentum has shifted. In the blink of an eye, the battle has turned. The Silver Surfer has taken control. But Thor is not a god for nothing. With a defiant roar he summons a massive lightning bolt, aiming it straight at the Surfer. This isn't just a casual spark, it's a cataclysm, a testament of the Thunder God's might, fueled by desperation and the will to survive. The Silver Surfer, sensing the impending danger, attempts to deflect it. But the sheer force of Thor's attack is overwhelming, he's a fraction of a second too late, caught off guard by the wrath of a cornered god. The collision of cosmic power and divine energy triggers an explosion, a spectacle of light and force that engulfs them. This is not a mere earthly thunderstorm but a clash of celestial titans, a display of raw power that sends shockwaves through the cosmos. As the dust settles only one figure remains standing, Thor, the god of thunder, emerges victorious. A battle fought with all their might, the Silver Surfer lies defeated while Thor stands tall. The God of Thunder's victory can be attributed to his exceptional strength, an attribute of his godly lineage. His resolute will, unbroken even in the face of overwhelming odds, played a pivotal role. Furthermore, Thor's strategic application of his powers was a key factor in this epic showdown. In this clash of titans, it is Thor, the God of Thunder, who has proven himself the mightier force.